This is tutorial 16 and it is the chamfer distance distance feature within SOLIDWORKS. To start off, open up the chamfer tutorial part which I have included on the DVD. Once that's open, let's click chamfer, click distance distance. Now in this feature, instead of using an angle and a distance, you're using two distances to create the chamfer. So let's click on one of the edges again and you can see a preview again of our distance distance chamfer. So let's start out both at 10 millimeters. And as you can see, as it increases, the chamfer changes and it increases also. So for the first one, let's make it 40 millimeters and 10 millimeters. Click accept and we can cut off that chamfer. Now, just like before, we can extrude out with the chamfer using the distance distance. Now for this one, let's make it 10 by 10. Click accept and we've chamfered out 10 by 10 there. Now on the back, let's click this line, click chamfer, click distance distance. And for the first one, let's make it 20. And instead of making this one 20, you're able just to click equal distance and they're both at 20. Click accept and then we've chamfered out at 20 and 20. Now let's click this line up here, click the chamfer, click the distance, unclick the equal distance, and let's keep extruding this all the way to the bottom, and let's make this go all the way to the side. Now click OK, and we've chamfered that whole plane there. This concludes our tutorial on the chamfer distance distance feature within SOLIDWORKS.